Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate um, German short rows. Um, so the first step in a German short row is to do um, what I've labeled as an SLP stitch. And that's where um, you'll go ahead and turn your work, knit up to the, you know, where the pattern tells you to, turn your work, and then slip the stitch purlwise onto the right needle and bring the yarn over the right needle and actually pull it. Oops. Can you pull your stitches on? Um, pull your yarn over the right needle so that these two legs from the stitch below come up. Um, and this creates um, a double stitch. And then you just go on your way. <clears throat> now, when you come back to that stitch, um, depending on the pattern, you'll, well, you'll always knit these two, this double stitch that was formed. Um, you can see as you're knitting, it, it does look quite different. So when you come up to it, um, if you're paying attention, um, it's, it's pretty obvious and easy to see. Um, in some patterns, you'll knit until a certain number of stitches before um, this SLP stitch and then you'll turn and, and do it again. And other times um, you'll knit right up to the stitch um, and then um, knit the legs together in either what's called a knit the legs together or else um, a knit the double stitch. So I'll knit that double stitch together, just treat it as one stitch, and then knit a certain number of rows past the stitch, um, and then turn and do it again, or, um, or just knitting all those double stitches together. And it looks really nice. It's, it's even, even in stockinette, it's, um, it's blends in really well. It doesn't leave any holes or anything. So thanks for watching.